Why are you interested in Zeitgeist? Um, I suppose, you know, it's about the time, like, we all kind of woke up from this, from the sleepwalk that a lot of us have been just kind of going through. And, 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 and yeah, I mean, it's, it's a kind of a shame in a way, like the way that most of people actually live their lives. I do be a woodwork at the moment in Govan. I don't know if you know Govan. Govan? Don't know, Gavin. But it's in the south side, right? And, and the community has been badly hit after the shut down was, was was shut down. And now they have. Um, I mean, there's there's a there's a lot of like um, increase in the drug abuse, um, alcohol abuse, crime, all these kind of things. And these are just basically direct or indirect attributes of your capitalism because if they close ship of the work is, is to actually save money and move it towards like somewhere cheaper again you know to to, to, to have more profit for themselves right um see you in the town so i can see your eyes yeah um so yeah, so it's, it's, it's um, I mean, there's, there's a whole lot of different issues to be honest. I mean, it's, I mean, you don't just, I mean, it doesn't just take a genius's mind, you know. You just have to kind of wait. You just have to kind of think outside the box for a second, and you kind of look around you, and you're like, wow, mm. is that, is that what is how it's supposed to be? At the, you know, at this day and age, which you live in, yeah. and things we actually would think as normal, you know, uh, um, just because of the generations and generations and generations of conditioning of what we've been made to think and and and, and, and act and, and, and speak. Mm -hmm. You know, the things that you consider as normal as anything but normal are way far from being normal. But things like Zeit Dice and all these other things, you know, they kinda of make people aware yep. of of how 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 it should be or, or what direction we can actually head towards. So yeah, so <laughs> hopefully that's that's the plan. Like you know, making more and more people aware. But I mean, the, the, I mean, the world that she is in a pretty bad state at the moment. Like you know, uh, I mean, a lot of people they have the, the amount of responsibility people have with the kids and everything else. So even if they did know, you know, even if they were a bit more aware. Of, of, of what's actually going on around us, they might not be able to actually pull themselves out of it. This, this, this is actually when you have a, a revolution taking place, is when an average person with two kids and, 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 and a wife who might actually know about, you know, how bad things are and how he's been taken advantage of, but wouldn't be able to you know, pull himself out of it because of the so many responsibilities around him. But a point where a person like that says, right, that's it, I've had enough, I'm going on the streets, is a time when you have like revolutions taking place and I think we are due a revolution anytime soon. And peer um, groups tend to peer groups tend to do these things together as well. So you yeah. won't just get like a singular individual do these things I mean peer groups definitely are an entity in of themselves they aren't, they're not like separate parts so really when when one person when you find one person's doing that you'll find that you know the status yeah, quo will shift that's, and that's what I mean like you know and, 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 I mean, uh, some of the people that have the kind of activist spirit about them anyway but the people that actually have like responsibilities for that when, when, it, when it hits people like that you know to an extent that they're prepared to like you know put everything behind them and come out in the streets is when you would actually have like masses of people that would actually come out in the streets you know which you've actually seen in so many different revolutions around the world and, and yeah so I think um, things like Zeitgeist and, and, and some of the other things that you contribute in, in a huge amount to to how how things should be done, you know, and how we should, we should live in our lives. Thank you. How long have you been interested in Zeitgeist? Do you know I watched the the, the first one that came out? I can't remember, I can't remember, a few years ago or something, I think four years ago the first one came out, I, came, I watched it not long after the first one came out. So about two or three years? Yeah, it's about two or three years, yeah. I watched it not long after the first one came out, so I've been preaching it since. <laughs> good stuff, good stuff.